But as for tonight in Sacramento, California, it is main event time for the Golden One Center. And if you want to talk about personal grudges, bad blood, and so much history between two competitors, look no further than Braun Breaker and Dolph Ziggler. The following contest is a steel cage match. Making his way to the ring from Woodstock, Georgia, weighing in at 230 pounds, Braun Breaker. This all started several months ago when Braun Breaker turned over a new leaf here on SmackDown and targeted the World Heavyweight Champion Drew McIntyre for the big gold belt. In his pursuit to become champion, Braun Breaker reignited an old flame with the show off Dolph Ziggler. With not one but two victories over Dolph, Ziggler came back for more, wanted to even the score with Breaker. The two men met in the first round of the King of the Ring tournament, and after a show stealer of a contest, Ziggler knocked off Breaker, a loss that Braun has not forgotten, and has all led to tonight. And his opponent from Hollywood, Florida, Weighing in at 218 pounds, Dolph Ziggler! A rivalry that once started NXT over the NXT Championship has bled over to Friday Night SmackDown over the last several months. And this is really one of those situations where two egos are clashing simply over the wins and losses that can propel a superstar's career. Braun Breaker looks at Dolph Ziggler as a man who took away an opportunity. Dolph Ziggler looks at Braun Breaker as a man who's trying to use Ziggler as a stepping stone in his SmackDown career. At the end of the day, only one man can get their hand raised from bell to bell. Breaker has defeated Ziggler. Zieg Ziggler has defeated Breaker. But it all comes down to this. For all the marbles tonight, for the bragging rights, to stroke their own ego, to be the better man, and who possibly take the next step here on SmackDown. It's Breaker, Ziggler, inside a steel cage. The bell has sounded and the main event is underway. Golden One Center, Sacramento getting a treat tonight. They've been an awesome crowd all night long. And before we take our trip to San Francisco in 48 hours, one more stop tonight here on SmackDown with this much anticipated conclusion to a monumental rivalry that has progressed over the last several months here on the Blue Brand. Remember these two men locked horns as well and had a meeting of the minds in that number one contenders match for the United States Championship that was inevitably won by Cody Rhodes several weeks ago. Just another opportunity that Ziggler and Breaker weren't able to capitalize on. But as we mentioned, Braun Breaker, he's looking to use Dolph Ziggler as a stepping stone, take that next step, level up, continue to progress here on Friday Night SmackDown, take another opportunity, and hopefully capitalize on it. As for Dolph Ziggler, he looks at Braun Breaker as a guy who is trying to do that, and Ziggler's not wanting to allow it. Ziggler does not want to be a stepping stone for anybody. Dolph Ziggler ain't slowing down anytime soon. Former world champion, former intercontinental, United States tag team champion, Ziggler has done a little bit of everything here in the WWE, but he wants another run in the main event. He wants his shot at a, at a United States or a world championship. And it starts here tonight by finally putting the bet, putting to issues, Ziggler almost got the win there, putting the issues to bed with Braun Breaker. Or remains to be seen what is going to happen inside the confines of this dangerous and destructive steel cage. That's why we are having the steel cage tonight. This easily could have been a normal one-on-one -on -one matchup, but it's time to settle the score once and for all. And these issues that have really been a several-year looming problem between Breaker and Ziggler. Throw him inside a steel cage. Anything and anything goes. As we just saw right there, Breaker sends Dolph into the cage and Ziggler's flesh, the first to come in contact with the cold, hard steel. It is not going to go well for Dolph Ziggler as this matchup moves forward. And he eats it again. That cage will rip your flesh apart. Leave you broken and battered limb by limb and Ziggler is finding that out firsthand. This isn't Dolph's first rodeo inside a structure like this, but certainly I will say, possibly the biggest match of Braun Breaker's young career here on SmackDown. Ziggler trying to start swinging. He knows after he just met the steel cage on numerous occasions early on in the contest. 
That could come back to bite him in the later rounds. Now Braun Breaker fighting an uphill battle against the show off at least for a moment. And you gotta wonder with so many high profile matches coming up this Sunday. Both the United States and world title from Friday Night Smackdown to be defended. Got to look at Ziggler and Braun Breaker and whoever wins this matchup is a possible challenger for one of those two championships in the near future. As we mentioned, this whole issue really got reignited between Breaker and Ziggler during Breaker's pursuit of Drew McIntyre's world championship and Ziggler got involved in the situation. Remember what was on the line in the King of the Ring tournament as well was not only the crown of the king, but the opportunity to challenge for your brand's world championship at SummerSlam, the right that Austin Theory earned and he'll get his matchup in 48 hours. That's what Ziggler and Breaker were fighting for. It really comes down to, again, the wins, the losses, the championship opportunities, the main event picture, and the bragging rights between these two men. That is what is at stake tonight. Neither man looking to leave Sacramento with an L. As now Ziggler is looking to stretch out Braun Breaker and make him feel the punishment. Steel cage or not, Ziggler, one of the best wrestlers from bell to bell in the entire universe. The Braun Breaker, as tough as they come. Nice reversal there, the former two-time NXT champion. He may have a bad attitude. Does that bruiser, that blue chipper Braun Breaker, but he knows how to get it done from bell to bell. Still a long career ahead of Breaker, with a lot to learn and a lot to overcome. But you can't knock the talent inside of the ring already. There's a reason he's a former two-time NXT champion. There's a reason he stood toe-to-toe -to -toe with Drew McIntyre a few months ago. There's a reason Breaker was a participant representing SmackDown and Money in the Bank last month. There's a reason Braun Breaker finds himself in the main event tonight. Dolph Ziggler knows that Braun Breaker's as tough as they come. He is finding it out firsthand right now as Breaker is in complete control of this steel cage match we may have spoken too soon. Well, there's a counter, and down goes the show-off. Dolph Ziggler is feeling it. Braun Breaker all over the show off. And Sacramento showing their displeasure for Braun Breaker here tonight. Ziggler is down. Ziggler is out. The show off is hurt. He has come in contact with that steel cage on numerous occasions. And Braun Breaker using his fist, his lefts, his rights, his powerhouse strength to demolish Ziggler inside of the ring. And there's a belly to belly. Remember where Braun Breaker comes from. This is a man, a part of the Steiner family. Nothing but bruisers inside of that squared circle throughout their careers. But Braun Breaker, the living embodiment of that again. Ziggler kicks out, but may have just been off adrenaline. May have just been off of instinct. Ziggler's got to get things going here. Braun Breaker will continue this onslaught over the show off and continue to pick apart Dolph for as long as Ziggler allows it. No referee that can stop this tonight. Anything goes, everything will happen inside of that steel cage as we are witnessing. And it ain't over to that bell sounds. It's a nice counter by Dolph. Able to get Breaker off from the least for a minute, get some distance, and a nice back suplex, and down goes Breaker. Ziggler's gotta get things going here. Sacramento behind Dolph Ziggler, and there's the zigzag. Ziggler going to the well with his best shot, but it's not enough to keep Breaker down. Dolph Ziggler throwing that zigzag at Braun Breaker. Knew he had to go with one of his best tricks to try to even the playing field in this match. But Braun Breaker still breathing, still with blood pumping through the veins. And on a pursuit to demolish Dolph Ziggler tonight. Ziggler trying to avoid whatever Breaker had in mind, but gets taken off his feet at least for a moment. This is your main event on this live edition of Friday Night Smackdown. We are here in the Golden One Center, Sacramento, California. And Dolph Ziggler goes face to face with a solid steel cage. And I believe Dolph Ziggler may have been busted open there. Not exactly sure from our vantage point, but Ziggler coming in contact head to head with that cage and certainly is going to feel it in the morning. Trying to stretch out Breaker again at the submission hold. Is he trying to win or is he just trying to wear down this hungry young son of a bitch in Braun Breaker? And Breaker gets out of it again. Dolph Ziggler sporting a crimson mask. That's only going to be a target for Breaker to seek out. 
Ron will become like a shark in infested waters, I promise you. And with nowhere to run in this steel cage, only so much distance you can create between you and your opponent. Dolph Ziggler has got to get back into this before Braun Breaker absolutely picks on the bones of the show off here tonight. Send it, Ziggler, full force into the cage again. My goodness. Dolph Ziggler is hurt. Ziggler is down, only really standing on his feet right now because of the ropes. Oh, and there's a counter by Dolph, using said ropes to his advantage. Breaker getting hung up on the top. Now Dolph Ziggler, ripping Breaker off, coming from behind, nice snap German. Great strength, great resilience out of Dolph Ziggler. Trying to show Braun Breaker that he messed with the wrong superstar tonight. Teach this young man some respect. Breaker down and Dolph Ziggler's wheels are a spin-in. Super kick turned round Sacramento. Ziggler unable to capitalize immediately. Into the cover now. Getting the two, but Braun Breaker kicks out. Ziggler with a last itch effort off that super kick. But the exhaustion set in, and Ziggler had to drag his own carcass over to cover Breaker, but it wasn't enough. Sacramento in appreciation of the performance of these two superstars. Bob Breaker avoided Ziggler's kick there, and now a nice scoop and a slam. And Dolph once again fighting an uphill battle. Dolph Ziggler. He hit that zigzag, he hit the super kick. Did he throw his best shots in this contest? Is Ziggler running on E? Is Braun Breaker about to pick on the bones of Dolph as we speculated on throughout this match? Ziggler on spaghetti legs. Braun Breaker again using the steel cage as a weapon. There were no escapes in this matchup. It can only be won by pinfall or submission. And Dolph Ziggler is absolutely worse for wear. And Braun is, oh, there's a shot by Ziggler. Dolph Ziggler, famous sir. Another way to create some distance. Another way to build some momentum. Big time famous sir, and I believe Braun Breaker may be busted open now as well. Dolph Ziggler with that right or left, whatever it was that he hit a moment ago. I think cracked open Breaker, bare knucks to the skull. The Famouser, however, wasn't enough, and Braun Breaker cut in Dolph in half with the super kick. Or excuse me, the spear. So much is being thrown in this matchup. Dolph Ziggler is exhausted, yet somehow still fighting. But Braun Breaker with a counter off the headbutt. Crimson Mass being sported in each corner of the ring. And although Dolph Ziggler is still fighting, how much does he have left in him? We see a reversal out of Dolph, and then Braun changes the trajectory in a matter of moments. Dolph sit upon the top. Now Braun Breaker going for that classic Steiner, Frankensteiner. And Dolph Ziggler. This may be all she wrote. Wait a minute, what's Breaker doing here? I thought he was going to go for the cover. Braun Breaker scale on the side of the cage by help of the top rope and drops an elbow to the sternum, or shall I say to the heart of Dolph Ziggler. Dolph Ziggler being brought to his feet by Breaker. Oh, wait a minute, goes for the super kick. Nobody home, Breaker now, off the reversal. Press slam, down goes Ziggler. Into the cover. And that'll do it. Braun Breaker writing the final chapter in these long storied issues between the blue chipper and the show off. Ziggler gave it all he had, but the young, tough, and resilient SOB that is Braun Breaker proving his worth and making a statement tonight on SmackDown. Here is your winner. Braun has waited months to... Coming your way on Saturday night, April the 13th, witness the aftermath of WrestleMania as the superstars of Monday Night Raw and Friday Night SmackDown head to San Juan, Puerto Rico for the 2024 Backlash.
This international live premiere event streams live at 5 p.m. Eastern time on Saturday night, April the 13th. And as a new season approaches, what will these superstars have in store? You haven't seen anything yet, and nothing can prepare you for the backlash.